we're at Crown today and we are celebrating Reconciliation Week and today we've had two key players from the West Coast Eagles, Sharon Wellingham and Josh Hill. So we are, they did come in today to celebrate, of course, Reconciliation Week, which is all about respect, relationships and opportunities. So it's great to have the two guys in today. I mean, they are role models for our employees and it's great to see them here today. We have a long, strong partnership with West Coast and you know, having the guys being partnered up with Crown is just a, it's a great opportunity. And like I said, with the employees, it's a great outcome for Crown and for West Coast. Are you looking forward to the new oval being across the road now? 2017, the new oval is going to be across the road? Definitely. Are you going to come watch the Eagles play over there? If I get the day off. Okay. Get the day off. <laughs> it was really great for one of our long-term employees, Terry, who's been here for 15 years to actually meet one of the West Coast Eagle players. A lot of interaction today and a lot of signage, so it went really well. So with the Indigenous Employment Program, and we've been ongoing for the last five years, and with the commitment from Mr James Packer, who's the Chairman of Crown, uh, we have committed to 2,000 jobs by 2020. So we've had 400 Indigenous employees come through the program, at present we've got 137 both, across both sites, you know, we're having real jobs and real opportunities. Yeah, it's awesome, it's been a uh, very nice welcome as you said and um, the seriousness in which they've um, approached the recon plan has been um, quite astounding, you know, the, um, the research and, and planning that's gone into it is uh, pretty awesome and so, you know, the numbers and, um, you know, projected outcomes that they want are, are really substantial which is awesome.